it. So last night we actually had a fairly chill night. Uh, we had a couple bottles of wine after dinner and then we went to a house party and it was actually kind of like a reunion because I hadn't seen a lot of these people since high school. I keep saying high school, university, so it was good to see them. Um, we got home pretty late so it wasn't that chill I guess. We got home at like 3 and slept on the floor so I'm kind of sore but nice to have somewhere to stay and somewhere this beautiful. We're up 29 stories right now and not a bad view. We're gonna head back to Vancouver and today is my mom's birthday. Yeah, happy birthday mom. We're back in White Rock and this is our weather. It is so, so gross out. The sky is just like one tone of gray. Yuck. Hi guys, it's me again. So. Oh, Christian's trying to get us killed. But we are driving right now because Christian needs to go get his mom a birthday present. May I add her birthdays today? If she watches this, she'll know I didn't get it for any time. Okay, well, I'll that out then. Um, I have a busy day ahead of me because I need to pack and for Toronto tomorrow morning. Then I'm going to a party on Tuesday night. I'll be vlogging. And he's gonna be really behind up on editing my vlogs, but I actually also have a vlog channel. So, you guys know follow my adventure there. Christian will link it down below. Yeah, Christian and I might go to a movie later. We were supposed to celebrate I got a little Valentine's Day celebration tonight, so we might just hang out, go to a movie, and then... Because she's leaving me on Valentine's yeah, Day. Yeah, we know I'm leaving him, but he's gonna drive me to the airport in the morning so we can hold hands. See you guys later. You got, like, attacked by a bear, Laura? <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, Laura leaves for Toronto tomorrow, so that will be fun for her. She's only gone for about two days, so she comes back Tuesday night. See you later. Bye. I lost my purse. <laughs> my hair is so crazy. Okay, I'm gonna go get some ice cream for my mom's birthday cake. Mission accomplished. Alright guys, dinner tonight was so good. Uh, we celebrated my mom's birthday and we went for a really nice dinner. And then we came home, had some cake, and family came over. And I thought, what better time to give you guys a tour of the crib than now. So, come on, check out my room. Over here we have an Ikea light. It's good. Brings light into my life. Um, this here is my bed. It's a memory foam. It never forgets. And this painting was painted by my aunt, Auntie Nicole, if you're watching. It's my favorite painting, thank you so much. And here is an assortment of clothing ranging from dirty to not dirty. It's hard to tell. Uh, this is where I like to put my towel after a shower in the morning. And I usually keep it here until it's time to turn the fan on, then I kind of move it. But in the meantime, I'll put it back here. Um, this is my closet of suits and dress shirts and yeah there's more shirts back there this is Tino Tino came traveling with Laura and I but Laura has not been a very good mother to Tino and she's a bit abusive so Tino only relates to me now Tino's my friend doesn't like Laura so much uh, that's Tim Tim the flamingo I actually painted him and you'll have to excuse Panda here he can get a little out of hand this is a man bun that I've never worn. This was also a gift from my aunt. Thank you, Auntie Gail. And this was my favorite teddy bear when I was a little kid. This is Tino. Everyone, ah, what am I saying? This is Snowy. Snowy was my favorite as a little kid. Tino's over here. And assortment of socks. Got a little mini rugby ball in case I feel like doing some sports. Why did you do that? And other than that, oh. Wouldn't be a room without this, would it? This is me. <laughs> Which one am I? Just kidding. I'm here. And this is my invisibility cloak. <laughs> Where'd Laura go? Oh, that's good. And so that's pretty much the end of my room tour. I used to have a bigger room, but then I moved out, and then I moved back home with my parents, and basically I got shafted. I feel like the ugly stepsister. But uh, yeah, my little brother stole my good room. And there's a room upstairs, but I've just never vacated up there. I like being downstairs. So things are a little tight in here, but my bed's super comfy. And I like how it's always cold in here because that helps me sleep. This has been a tour of the crib. Thanks for joining me. See you in the next one. Oh, yeah.